what's up guys welcome back to a brand new video today's video is going back to the sneakers video um if you're not yet subscribed make sure you hit the subscribe button and make sure you guys enter the giveaway man i'm only gonna have it for like two weeks and then i'm gonna announce the winners so yeah so today we actually purchased some essentials hoodies yesterday last night and we got a couple of them right we got buttercreams we got the whites and we got the the oatmeal ones but the only thing is that they might be fake guys we don't we're not 100 percent sure right now but the material is very off but the only thing is that these are from 2020 right um the ones i'm wearing now they're from 2022 so the material might be very very different but but when when we've been like looking at videos to tell the difference between fake and real some of the stuff looks fake so and they're not oversized and i think essentials are known for oversized t-shirts and clothing in general so i'm gonna go um to the mall to see if someone can spot if they're fake or real and yeah we'll let you guys know and stay tuned guys all right guys so right now i'm on my way to um to panga mall because um that's the only mall or like stores we know where they can possibly check if they're real or fake so we're gonna go well i'm gonna go to the mag park i hope they can spot the difference of real fake and yeah i really hope they're real because if not uh we did take a big loss on them guys that's all hello i just have a question would you be able to tell if these are real or fake because we bought a bulk that they're fake yeah that's what i'm saying we didn't know because it was 2020 so, um, even the, the those came in the uh, no? not good they didn't even make that color they didn't make white because i saw it on stock eggs there's not a fake on stock right now okay so, this one they actually did make um but the label's wrong it's too this is too thick too thick Silicone feels like it feels a little too weird. Okay. It's supposed to be thicker, like more raised off. Okay. Uh, but yeah, it feels like, and then the bags, obviously. All right, I appreciate it though. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Yep. All right, so I went and basically they said that this one is no good. They said that the the font itself, it's like stuck in, it has to be popping out, kind of. The tag is very, I think it was thick or thin, either or. And then this one as well, same thing. It's not popping out. And the tag as well. And then for this one, he said, they didn't even make this color. Like, and I even told him, but we saw it on StockX. He's like, Stock is selling fakes from nowadays. Really? Yeah. They don't even make white? No. He said they didn't even make white. He says that he's assuming that they probably made it in the same factory, which is like maybe after hours, but yeah, these are all fake. Damn. So that's how much of a loss? Um, like 750, I think. Down the drain. So yeah, so I mean, we're gonna contact um, the person that sold us this and hopefully we get him to return the money. Like I said, we're not gonna disclose his name if he decides to you know um give us back the money but if he doesn't then um i don't know you win, you win some you lose yeah some, that's huh? what i said you win some you lose some you learn you live and you learn and yeah i mean next step is just to contact the person that told it to us i'm right, gonna call the guy see the answers Please leave your message for eight one eight four. Well, maybe he's working. You know, yeah. let's not assume right now. You know, he might be working. I'm gonna text him. Can you give me a call? As soon as you can. Alright. Well, well, we'll wait. We'll yep. Alright guys, so um it's currently like eight PM. He finally answered us 
and then he said to meet him up at the same spot where we did the deal so we're here and we're just gonna wait for him he said he was gonna be here at eight so he should be here in like five minutes this is the first time we've ever like encountered something fake this has never happened to us we just didn't want to doubt him because it was a 2020 essentials and maybe kanye was cheap back then we don't know so it's like it was a 2020 essential so it was like uh like six drops before like these kinds of drops so it's like we didn't know if like the material was different so we didn't want to you know but we actually checked them out as you guys saw in the footage and they turned out to be fake i mean he probably didn't even know i'm pretty sure he probably didn't even know but hopefully he gets his refund back from the other guy because he bought in bulk so yeah let's see how this goes guys <laughs> So he actually ended up pulling up. He he was very like he didn't know what was going on. So he actually didn't know that they were actually fake, and he refunded us the money. So I mean that's a plus for us. It could have been someone else and been like never shown up, but good thing that he actually showed up and like he was a cool dude. So yeah, I mean look out for fakes, guys. They have some stuff that like it could have passed for real, but some stuff was like it seemed very fake so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys learned a little something about like real and fake and then how businesses can like you know buy fakes and not really know about it and make sure you guys enter that giveaway the giveaway is gonna end in like two weeks so make sure you guys enter it go to our instagram so you can see the giveaway it's already posted so yeah enter that giveaway and we'll see you on the next one guys